good morning good afternoon good evening wherever you're watching from you're welcome to attend you for real youtube channel eka ro eka son eka le no bonjour salama po ina kwana ina ini ya dan gana ga lokacin da kake kallon wannan video yes it is an exciting day a wonderful one at that and a lot of things are ongoing as today it's a very special day happy pi day to each and every one of you watching this live or maybe later on as we are progressing on this so it is the um happy fourth anniversary of the pi network community's existence okay the pi network project and i tell you this is coming right straight from at cindy for real so Guys, you need to buckle up and stay tuned as I'll be taking you round to all of the stuff that we have to discuss today. The achievements and all of those other things that we have right here, right now. Don't go anywhere. Stay tuned and let's progress. Just like I rightly told you before the break, it is Pi Day today and a lot of people are celebrating it, a lot of the community members. And I tell you right here, right now, we are on the Pi Revolution X Twitter page. And they went on to say right here, Pi Day, Hackathon, Mass KYC, and one year of the new era. New Twitter space to observe Pi Networks Day, Pi Day within Justin Wu, Aoku and Doris, hosted by Woody, set a reminder to join the special event and retreat. And of course, right here you can see, this is it. Happy Pi Day, Pioneers. Say it back. Say, of course, in the comment area, it is Pi Day. Um, Hackathon, Mask KYC, and one year of the new era. It is actually dated uh, to be discussed on the 15th of March. Uh, 2023 time 4 p.m west african time and venue is by revolution twitter spaces okay so this is awesome as you can see uh this wonderful pioneers right here woody light here right here who is the host and uh, that's woody right there in red and we have the second person which is just justin Wu, and we have iq and doris yin yeah of course so it's exciting a lot of things are going on and pioneers are set to celebrate this and also to make some wonderful discussion to where we have gotten to as we have joined from four years to this very place many have joined us along the way okay and some of us are just starting this year so guys it is exciting uh, to see uh, Pi at four and a lot of things have been achieved as you can see uh, right here this day there are some wonderful thing which is Pi Hackathon which we are having the second Pi Hackathon so far Mass KYC which has been scaling really really fast right and um, we have millions of people who have KYC at the moment and the app keep on you know uh, you know, uh, kind of like scale more and more and we are gradually getting there. The growth has been organically. So it is exciting. I'm very, very happy and pleased today. And one year of a new era, basically because guys, a wonderful journey started one year ago. So guys, let us go on and see some of the interesting things happening in the Pi Network uh, uh, community right today as we have the Pi Day because Pi was actually uh, created on the four, on the yeah 14th of March 2019, right? That is 2019. So it has been a wonderful journey, an impressive one. And oh man, if you've been there from day one, then you should love the journey. If you have been following up, being updated. So guys, let us go straight into other news. Okay, so right here is one of the great achievements that have actually happened. This is at Pi New Zone, all right? He tweeted approximately 1.72 billion Pi coins have been migrated to mainnet. This is a great landmark, guys. This is a great achievement. And 75% of the migrated coins is locked for a certain period while 25% is available for use. So that's for bartering, the ones available for use. And right here, Pi Network mainnet migration in progress. And of course, a lot of things are ongoing. Mainnet, it is it's all a journey to mainnet. We have Pi KYC, which is still ongoing. We have the SDK. Okay. Um, it is exciting, guys. 
it is exciting and uh, for those of you who don't really know what a SDK is, is software development kit, which is actually enabling our uh, use our uh, builders to, uh, you know, kind of like work things their way very, very softly. So, guys, let's look into other yes. news. Yes, yes. What are those some of the event? What are those events happening in other countries? Right here, we have Pi News Media, one is, which is one of my favorite news media here in the Pi Network community stated out and said some pioneers in India have started cutting the cake to celebrate Pi Day. So happy Pi Day to you guys. And coming right down here, wow, this is a beautiful cake made in the form of Pi logo. Wow, I love this. All right, so these are the pioneers right here celebrating Pi Day and it is just simply amazing. Wow. Okay, so right here is something I found really, really interesting for us to know what the Pi Core theme is building. So here is a tweet about 16 hours at the time of me making this video. And it's coming right straight from at Edwin2199, who is part of the Pi Chain Mall team. He said, I got a new finding just now at Gate Yoti. Okay, the Gate Yoti just received another 10 million <coughs> euro. That is 10 million 10 millions euro funding and their kyc user base is 12 millions all right so while pi network <clears throat> uh that is pi network uh at pi core theme decentralized kyc solution is aiming to kyc 35 million users and need to be scalable so billions of users can be kyc -ed. now let me tell you why he's breaking down this so that you can get the message right here Okay, so this is Ben, okay, at K Crypto Invest, which is who is the co-founder um, of BSC News. Now, look at what he said right here. Quick, Pi, K, Pi Network KYC thoughts. He said the cost of KYC can range from a couple of dollars to $100 per KYC if using a third-party service provider. If even 2 million pioneers apply for kyc that will cost a minimum of two million dollar to the pi core team if they paid out of pocket it would likely be higher okay it will likely be higher and right here he stated out something okay it's very very important so um Actually, Edwin is stating out some very important key features that the Pi Core theme is building its own. This simply tells us that in the future, uh, the Pi Core theme Pi KYC uh, solution is going to be something that can be, uh, you know, given out there as a third party application to other communities. And this will bring in funding, all right, for the Pi Network community. So I tell you guys, it is a good. Um, a preparation that the Pi Core team is doing and let us keep on supporting them as they are working very very hard to get this done and it is scaling it has been scaling because if you've been with the team from uh, uh you've been with the project or community for a while you can see that the Pi Core team has been making it possible for this app to scale from the beginning it wasn't like that there was uh just some slots giving out i think 100 or 300 to each country right which the first hundred to test run uh all of those things uh were really really uh let's say the foundation of all of this stuff so let us be uh bear it in mind and be sure that yes the pi core team is building something incredible and it's going to be something that can be of great utility to the pi network community so guys there are a bunch of messages out there. Uh, a lot of people are celebrating the Pi Day. And we right here on this channel also, we are celebrating the Pi Day. And it's simply amazing because, come on, it has been a very successful journey, a nice one at that. And it is just feels so good to be here that the Pi Day is here once again, the fourth one at that. So, guys, that will be the video for today. But until then, when I get some interesting news for you, I will bring you up the I will give you up I will keep you updated and I will let you know. But until then, I say bye for now. Once again, I say happy fourth year anniversary to all pioneers, to the Pi Core theme, and to the whole of the entire ecosystem. So right here, right now, once again, it's at Tindy for real. And I'm out. I say bye for now.